everybody. It's Tara from PDQ. Today we are going to talk about Patch Tuesday for March 2024. So it's our third Patch Tuesday this month. Actually pretty good compared to last month. Last month we have 77 five critical. This month we have 59 with just two critical. And the good news is zero have been exploited. Let's take a look at what we got. Well, we're gonna talk about three. Even though two are critical, I got three to show you because three's fun. The first one, I'm not gonna read the whole thing because you guys can read. So 21400, ooh, I like this one because it's, it's interesting. It talks about Azure Kubernetes. So AKS is Azure Kubernetes Service. You know how I feel about acronyms. So I'm gonna read the whole word. Uh, this one's kind of scary, actually. So uh, it talks about the hacker being able to leverage this vulnerability, steal credentials, and then just kind of go hog wild. They can leave Kubernetes and just wreak havoc in your environment. So the suggestion is to, and Kubernetes is a little bit different. There's no um, permissions necessarily, so they suggest that you update the container and the container that they suggest i got to read this because it's a, it's interesting it is the comp con or again the real word confidential computing container so if you use kubernetes if you know you know update that one pretty important one and that one has a nine severity so kind of a big one Go do that one. Next up, we have 21407. Uh, this one is a remote code execution. Uh, this one, in order to exploit it, they got to be in your environment. So some hurdles there. And this involves a guest VM. So uh, think hypervisor, think parallels, think uh, virtual box. So they got to be inside, though. But if they are inside, uh, they can run a remote command. If you have this, patch this one ASAP. This is an 8.1, but uh, again, remote code execution, so get on that one. Next up, we have 26198. This is another remote code execution with an extra bonus of uh, exchange and for extra fun users. <laughs> yeah, that's right. It uh, has a user interaction bonus points. If the user clicks on a malicious file, it loads a DLL and then the remote attack. So for my money, this one's terrifying. It has an 8.8. .8. So this one probably affects the most people. So go do that one straight away. But you know what? All in all, pretty light month comparatively. So I'm going to take it. Go patch. My work here is done for PDQ. I'm Tara.